as a guest, you would come to Filoli, you would be greeted at the front door uh, by the butler, and then the butler would take you to the two rooms, the gentleman and the ladies' cloak room, and you would freshen up, and he would escort you out here, and you would meet the family here, and then you would sit down and have uh, tea and scones or whatever, and enjoy your time with the family. This is the dining room. This was where the guests, after the food was prepared, the family would meet in here. And if you were a guest, you would come from upstairs and you would come down and you would share with the family the, the dinner or lunch. Mr. Bourne's favorite expression was, fight for a just cause, love your fellow man, and live a good life. Fi, lo, vi. The Bournes built it from 15, 1915 to 1917, and they stayed until 1936 when they both passed away. Very wealthy, they got m the majority of their money from the Empire Mine. Uh, the Roths bought it in 1937, and they were equally wealthy, but they owned the Matson Navigation Line, and they stayed till 1975, when at which time Mrs. Roth gave it to the National Trust for Historic Preservation. It's just sort of like going back into a period that's not that common in San Francisco, um, or at least not open to us, you know. So this is a great treat. We've been following Downton Abbey on television, and coming here we sort of have an idea of what it must be like to have a house with servants, and it's just lovely. Everything's so beautifully laid out, and then the gardens are just spectacular. The gardens at Filoli are considered an extension of the house. Just as the house has rooms, so does the garden. It's an English garden, basically. It's a little eclectic, but it is considered an English garden. It's spring, so we have uh, bulbs. We have tulips and daffodils. The tulips are probably the most popular. Oh, I love the flowers. I love the tulips. I didn't expect tulips. I expected the daffodils, but not the tulips. It's been beautiful in the highest scent. Beautiful. More flowers than I usually see when I come here in May, so I was just very happy.